What's good, life gainers? All knowing, all loving, all feeling, all seeing, all powerful. Just damn all everything. Sex is Hell host of the Life Gains channel, bringing you guys streaming, media, entertainment, fitness, financial advice. We do it all on this channel. Your life gain for today, for my comic book fans and folks out there, Justice League has thrown up the smoke screen and a big reveal as to who is going to be the villain in the upcoming Justice League movie. For so many of us, we've been teased thinking it was going to be Dark Side. I told y'all, pump the brakes. Why would they go ahead and give you the big baddest of them all from the DC Universe so fast? And I guess because they showed his parademons and all that, we thought that that's who it was going to be. Check out this interview that they're doing with the person who is playing the villain. Now, I still have a conspiracy thought that somehow, some way, somebody's going to take over Superman, resurrect him, and make him part of what the Justice League is going to have to fight alongside whoever this bad villain is. I don't want to say his name till you guys see the clip. So take a look at the clip, and then we're going to talk about it. It's going to be quite a busy year for you anyway, because you've got you've got big movie coming out at the end of the year, the, the, the new Justice League. Uh, yeah. I, I, Which, and we were talking earlier, you're not a comic book person. No, not really. No, this person. this came out of the blue, in a way. Oh, uh, I'm obsessed well, with it. Blue. Okay. And the fact that you're in it is, is really exciting for me. Oh, so, well, I'm thrilled to be here. I'm sorry I'm not in costume. <laughs> I didn't well, even have a costume when I was doing it, so... Well, ha explain. Uh, it's all done, what's it called, motion capture. So uh, basically they stick a helmet on your head, they put two cameras around and they capture all your expressions, uh, facial expressions. So basically they're going to concoct some kind, some kind of construction, and they will use my facial expressions, eyes, mouth. So the performance voice. they will then they turn can, into will a... turn into this uh, murderous, re avenging uh, Steppenwolf from uh, the planet Apocalypse, apparently. Well, of yeah. course, <laughs> who's, who's bent on hell uh, on Earth? Yeah. Oh, I can't oh, wait. Right. I can't. Have you seen Wonder Woman? You wouldn't have seen Wonder Woman. Uh, no, but I don't know whether they're all afraid to come and meet me. I know they weren't really because I was, you know, I was, it's imaginary work. You do it with green screen. So are you with the other actors or are you no. having to do, you have to do the whole thing? That must yeah. be a bit of a challenge. Well, yeah, most things were a challenge for me, Michael. But, I mean, <laughs> that was another challenge, you could say, yeah. But uh, it was quite fun. And they're very encouraging in what you do and suggesting over here, look over there, imagine that, do this here, they're coming at you now. Very, I mean... As a, for an actor, a, a, a lovely thing to be able to be part of a huge franchise like the Justice League, the, the superhero movies, um, th then go back into the theatre to do something that, that, that yeah, I've been very, fun. I've been very fortunate that way. I don't and know of course, why. Yeah. I'm sure everybody now is recognising you for for your work in Game of Thrones. Yeah, I do. I wouldn't say I get I get accosted regularly, but uh, I'm it. noticed occasionally. <laughs> <laughs> you work on it. Yeah, work harder at it. That's right. You guys heard it. Probably not going to be Dark Side, but it's going to be one of his main hitchmen, Steppen Wolf. And from what I'm hearing, they're going to have him kind of dressed up like Ares was in um, Wonder Woman's movie. Sorry if you haven't seen it. I didn't mean to spoil it for you. But I'm assuming they're going to have him. Somehow or another, Superman's going to be resurrected and he might have be a little evil, a little twisted. Somehow they're going to get his mind control and he's going to fight alongside him until the Justice League beat the shit out of him and make him realize he fights for good. But Steppenwolf is going to be your big baddie in this movie. I want to know in the comment section, how do you guys feel about that? In the comic books, there are some storylines where Steppenwolf is very powerful. They make him pretty, pretty badass, but the cartoons haven't made him all that badass. But the way that they're trying to diagram this guy and some of the response people have given them from the way they dressed up Ares and the Wonder Woman, I think DC is trying to put a lot of money, time, and effort into making sure this is a menacing Steppenwolf en route to future Justice League movies. How do I feel about it? Y'all know I don't like to be teased. I want to go ahead and get the dark side. But hopefully they'll make Steppenwolf menacing possibly bring in Superman as a help for, helper to him to make the movie really, really good and the Justice League will do great battle with them. I mean, guys, we got to look at it like this. DC is trying to get their stuff together. They're getting everything set up to have a universe and maybe this is going to be a great step in going in that direction. So we'll just see how badass Steppenwolf is. 
Let me know, are you ready for a step in Wolf versus Justice League? And we're going to keep watching this thing as it unfolds. That's going to do it for this video. Don't forget to like my video, comment, and subscribe. Please click that bell so you get an alert every time I drop a new video. Become a Patreon on behalf of this channel. I've got a few that are doing that now. Check out my past videos. Check out the links I got below in my video description box. Do business with my affiliates. Do business with me. Till that next sex as hell video, I'll see you. If you enjoy the content on my channel, please take your cursor. Click the subscribe button. If you want to receive an alert every time I drop a new video, click the little bell. And if you want to connect with me on Facebook, you can click this button. If you want to connect with me on my other social media, I got a button for you here, a button for you here. And if you're one of those people that want to make a donation, donations can be made through my Patreon account by going to www.patreon.com forward slash life gains. You can also get private videos done. This is how you can support my channel. Just click here and become a Patreon and you will continue to get great content by LifeGain.